Good afternoon, dear Excellency, Ambassador of Norway, dear colleagues and, and friends. Uh, like Agla mentioned, uh, we have in our audience here physically our staff of university, staff of university professors, uh, and in the lunch time we can discuss discussion more have uh, about our activities and, and uh, like like from presentation Uwe, we heard that universities and academic is very very strong partner and uh, an actor in in, uh, in creating of ecosystem of Klepa the region ecosystem and about I, I can I, I just want to start from from definitions uh, and blue economy definition in recent decade the blue economy or ocean marine economy has been widely advocated by an area of inter interested parties. Interested parties as a concept of or a strategy for safeguarding the world oceans and water resources. And like you know, blue economy is originated from United, United Nations Conference on Sustainability Development held in Rio de Janeiro 2012. And the term blue economy has been used in different ways and similar terms such as ocean economy, marine economy, and are you without clear definition. And more recently, the, the World Bank's definition is comprehensive concept and we embracing multi aspects of oceanic sustainability ranging from sustainable fisheries and ecosystem health and preventing pollution. And in summary, blue economy as a macroeconomy concept involves every aspect of national and global governments, economic development, environmental protection, and sustainability and international, international communication. Blue economy is an integration and sustainable development of green growth. And it's very important that the uh, role of education in research and in the EU Blue Economy Report reset recently in two, 2021. This year there's a fourth, fourth edition in EU Blue Economy Report and EU yearly continues to analyze the scope and size of blue economy in European Union. And we heard from the European Commissioner uh, about it uh, for importance for e European Union. And here is the place where universities and research institutions should step in and foster blue economy through innovation. And we, we can see university impact through education. Uh, we have here three columns uh, where academic and, and uh, universities may act this education, students training, and my aim is today to show our examples of Clayton University when, when we do and when we act in, in, in such way and training of top level professionals for blue economy sectors, attracting talents, inclusion of industrial partners into the teaching and training for, net, for talents as well. Science and innovation column is national, international research project in Clayton the University is about 100 annually and research and innovation for industry of region and good practice for sustainable development coastal areas and, and as well as collaboration with industry uh, industries very important and uh, stakeholders and innovative research uh, problem solving based and sustainable economic development of region and some Examples of uh, innovation I, I, I today will show from our experience. One is uh, Blue Growth Leader Academy, and, uh, and it's uh, like you see our partners, Klaipeda the uh, Klaipeda Moxlo, Klaipeda Science and Technology Park, and Andrew Sutnikas is the main, main leader in, in such way. And, and the aim of is to mobilize and 
of the leaders of maritime business and science and contribute to the implementation of Clayper, the blue breakthrough strategy. Like you know, blue growth as well, one of definition of blue economy and, and uh, synonyms of, of uh, uh, in definition and philosopher defini definitions. And program offers of opportunity to meet top experts from all across Europe. Norway is main, our partner in, in such project in, in this project and become a part of networking platform dedicated to the blue economy. And uh, in the Blue Growth Leader Academy, we, we have industries and port and shipping, blue biotechnology, sea and coastal tourism and innovation management and business strategy. The next one is, is investment. We are creating a steam center and, and we I suppose that the, it will be in the opening in, in 2023, from the September, 1st September of 2023. And STEAM centers, uh, we, we, we will have a laboratories of biology, chemistry, physics and engineering, robotics and IT, and specialized marine sciences and technology research area. Now we have uh, our uh, infrastructure now, now creating infrastructure in, in our campus uh, for this investment. Uh, engineering classes, we start for three years before, engineering classes in Balta, Glipeda Balta's gymnasium. And now we have three classes. Uh, we start from one class and, and this year we have three classes and, and 13 university professors lectures are teaching at the school and we have uh, Rima Mitzkevich you know, who, who is former dean of, of faculty and it's, it, it, it is a very important person for creating this, this, uh, this engineering classes. The first clip of the university gymnasium is established in the summer, Gemina University Gymnasium, gymnasium near, near the clip of the university campus, and, and uh, the aims is strengthening links with schools and regions and, and bringing research, researchers to schools and training to, of talents. It's, it's very important for, for the first column, like I said before. Um, employees uh, uh, quality label investor spotlight awarded to Clayper the university programs as well as very important and we have now six six program who who was uh, qualified and, and investor spotlights label and maritime transport engineering mechanical mechanical engineering electrical engineering informa informatics informatics engineering and chemical engineering and Science and innovation and examples for collaboration with system, the industry and stakeholders. I, I can show here in this slide, intelligence, transport, smart industry development on autonomous passenger ferry technology prototype. We start with Western Baltic engineering ship building group ship and, and autonomous green port of future development of a new container handling method and system prototype and uh, make more effect, uh, efficient use of existing loading technologies and increase of the level of autonomy of leading facilities, reduce energy consumption. That's very important in the blue economy from the blue economy point of view. Uh, and uh, like you know, the dancer bus was uh, start from Klaipeda universities and now university we uh, we have about a third of the manufacturer staff at uh, graduates of Klaipeda university and you one but uh, you can see before the last last week or, or two weeks before we creating a new one electric ship is one of founders of wind and solar transport alliance since 2012, and about a third of manufacturer staff are graduates of Klaipeda University and, and very project, like I said. And we was, uh, Uwe was mentioned about medicine and, and health, it's very important as well, and our uh, health sciences faculty uh, from since 2011 works in such area with geothermal water by balneology, balneotherapy, and with Icelandic cluster we have some, some, uh, some cooperation 
and, uh, and studies of geothermal water in Klaipeda University revealed significant positive effects of nerves, nervous, cardiovascular, pulmonary, musculoskeletal skin and gave preventive effects of integral health risk and holistic view of the health and it's from this point is very, very important as well. Our, one of our activities is Fortum, in Fortum uh, manufactures production of high value added products and cultivation of microscopic green algae for astaxanthin pigment extraction and, and, and competences of our, from our side, from Klaipeda University is optimization of cultivation conditions for biomass production determination of stress condition for pigment synthesis and, and no, as well as knowledge is transferred to Fortum like staff training. Aqua, aquaculture biotechnology, like Agla mentioned, uh, tomorrow we will have our presentation. Uh, Nerius Nika, uh, we have a corona and split uh, laboratory of aqu aquaculture near or from this site and maybe two kilometers from here. Uh, and and uh, this uh, more, more explanation tomorrow Nerius Nika in, in, in our conference can, can do because the use of marine recirculating system in shrimp aquaculture, use of ge geothermal water in aquaculture is, is quite new for, for our scientists and researchers as well. And you can see here in pictures, and aquaponic is, is a new, a new method and methodologies of, of, for researchers is very interesting as well. And, and, and here we, we, we have uh, Tatiana, Pulauskin in our audience, and uh, she is the uh, main, uh, main uh, researcher in in aerogel of material that allows to remove oil pollutions from environment and quickly. And spin-off was created maybe recently, to, to, to two or three months before in, in Klaipeda University, together with Klaipeda University, and, uh, in our aerogel is sustainable, more than twice as light and efficient, and can be reused up to five times. But then maybe in lunchtime you, you can more explain about your innovation. It's very interesting for, for, for our future development of Klaipeda, in, in Klaipeda University for transferring our ideas to, to technologies. And uh, is uh, Arctic expedition to Spitsbergen, to Norway administration, uh, Iceland, and uh, our uh, professors and academic uh, Sergei Olenin, uh, he is uh, the main researcher in this expedition and main goals for participation in the Arctic expedition is to increase the uh, competences of our researchers and latest knowledge use participation and, and, and uh, we have some, some interesting data and, and published this data uh, this year uh, and, and we have some interesting uh, future experiments in, in our mind and our researchers mind. Uh, Mintis, our research vessel, is uh, one of the Klaipeda University fleet, fleet vessels who work uh, actively in, in blue economy, uh, in blue economy field and uh, acoustic, acoustic laboratory, geo laboratory, bio laboratory, and multifunctional open decks for various offshore research operations uh, for remotely operating vehicles, diesel electric propulsion system, and, and more and so more. And uh, another our uh, f vessel from our fleet is Brabander uh, and the water investigation and recognition and research of shipwrecks and bottom of the Baltic Sea and, uh, and the water surveys by divers, documentation, photography, video recording and, and so on. Uh, Andrew Sutnikas <laughs> is responsible for, 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 for this uh, liquid natural gas cluster, but, we, uh, but the, now this cluster developed more and then maritime cluster we have. On, and you can see partners on Klippa University, one, on, uh, one of the 
first who, who start together with with clay uh, science technology park and 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 now it's uh, maybe in uh, on the lunch time we, we can more discussion in such area and how how act our our cluster it's it's very important and clay and uh, and and Yurgita, uh, i think we can more discussion today about, about possibilities in, in such area. University business uh, and university cooperation in this year more active will, will start in, in February establishment of endowment agreement of uh, Claypada University Future Support Fund was signed and, and we have now f foundation of nine nine uh, stakeholders, uh, Lina Sagro, Argus, uh, Vakarula, Ivu, Gamikla, we can guarantee group and other, and, and uh, was signed and clear and transparent mechanisms for business to contribute to the development of higher education in the region. It's very important and opportunity for business and science to consolidate forces and financial and intellectual resources to solve difficult problems of the region. Uh, here we can, our, uh, in this slide we can see our establishing, establishing the first, first. And strategic development uh, for university and for city, uh, it's very important, uh, like we talk, ab uh, uh, talk about EU connections since 19, since 2019, European Commission decided that, that uh, in Europe, in Europe will, will be create create new new type of universities, and, and the EU connections uh, one of Clayton University is a part of this uh, this EU connections uh, uh, European University of Smart Urban Coastal Sustainability, and and uh, like you can see in this slide, it's uh, six universities who are creating now the leaders: La Rochelle University in France. Uh, Universitat Catolica de Valencia, Spain, all, all cities, all universities is coastal universities and, and near, near the coastline and, and uh, now we have three associated partners and uh, Waterford Uni University, Institute of Technology Island, University of Rostock and Frederick University in Cyprus and uh, next, next uh, week we have our government board management board uh, in Zadar University in Croatia and uh, very active active uh, in, in such such uh, project main ob main objectives uh, European University Connexus is a joint academic office and, and we have now two two specialization of minor uh, joint minor program as well as one uh, one program and master degree in, in bio, biology and, and uh, in blue biotechnology. It's uh, like it's uh, very uh, very similar to to blue bio uh, for, for for blue economic. And we have uh, uh, in our strategic plans a joint research areas and and synergy syn, synergy and innovation and joint area, life sciences and biotechnology, environmental sciences and biodiversity, coastal engineering and social science and culture and human sciences. And, and it is a hub of excellence in smart urban coastal sustainability. And as well in, in our future development and strategy, we have a joint PhD program in such, such pro, in, such pro, in this uh, project. Thank you very much for your attention.